Hello and welcome back. I don't usually make coffee videos in afternoon, but I'm going to make exception today because it's about almost four o'clock on today is what Wednesday afternoon. Anyway, so my work is pretty slow at the shop, so I decided to close on, close down early, and I stopped by the secondhand stores. So you know, when I was walking around, I found this. I got this beautiful cup so this is more like uh let's say it's about three ounces so this is good for espresso really cute and also i found this a uh, milk uh milk jug okay milk uh, kind of a latte art teacher but the the one thing i like about that is you see that right here those you know spout i guess is different than the bravo okay this is very narrow so I think this is better for latte art, I think. Uh, for today, I'm going to use this one, make myself cappuccino. So this afternoon, I'm going to use Good Brothers Coffee, their special blend. So I'm going to use that as well. So this is nicely roasted. This is about medium roast. So let's try that. Uh, what else? Oh, yes. One more thing. I got a gift from one of my customer, not the customer, my viewer. Okay. Uh, he made me a the 3D dosing funnel uh, from Singapore. I'm going to shout out to Sai. Thank you, Sai. I'm going to use this. So lately, I've been using 17 grand, but uh, the other day, I tried with 16 gram the dosing amounts, and surprisingly, it, it, it was great. So uh, this afternoon, I'm going to try 16 and go from there. So this 3D dosing part is really easy to use. Just simply, I'm gonna wipe it. I'm gonna wipe it first. And then you just uh, clip on like this, like that. And that's it. The great thing about this one I like, with the metal dosing funnel, I mean, you just, you have to be, you, you have to use it like this. If not, it fall out. For this one, just clip on, and so this is really cool. So, uh, like this, I'm just going to flip it over, shake it. So now I have a very flat uh, beans to work with. Since I'm going to do cappuccino, so I'm going to use cappuccino mug from uh, Lino. I think it's Lino. It's about six ounce i believe no eight ounce i think so we're gonna try this one so right after putting the shot i'm going to steam the milk right away so so that's what we're gonna do here we go hopefully we're gonna get some good shot here Pressure looks good. It's about one o'clock. Very dark and rich coloring. But meantime, I'm gonna get the milk ready. So milk is getting hot now. So this is done. I'm gonna wipe it clean and flush. So this milk looks good. Kinda like, it look like white paint. Okay, so the other day I was watching a latte video again. So what they do is they transfer uh, milk to other uh, water picture, I mean milk picture, so that's what I'm gonna do. So, like this. So let's do some latte art here. Oh, 
Okay, like half something, okay. I don't know. Hold on. I thought milk uh, quality was very good. I thought the texture was really good. But my latte art is still questionable. But I mean, it looks, you know, it looks good. I mean, I like the really the milk quality, it's just nice and f very well, fluffy. I don't want to say fluffy, but you know, very thick. So let's try this. Cheers. So whole milk is the way to go, very sweet. They bring out a lot of sweetness there. Man, the, the Good Brothers, the, the, his uh, special blend is wonderful. Uh, I'm gonna put the link below as well. I think he give out 25%, 25% off. So I think that's a pretty good deal. Anyway, uh, let's see, this is really good. And then, uh, so this method, you know what? Not bad actually. So it's a lot, seems like a lot easier than using this uh, very short tip. So this is, has more room to, you know, they have a more uh, width, I guess. So this only cost me, what, $3? So I think it's worth the money. Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. If you have any questions or comment uh, down below and if you liked it, and let's see, uh, make sure to follow me on the Instagram as well. See you guys next time.